Excellent to see you again. So this is the same question as before, but I just want to give you one more method. So we have to find the area of this compounded figure. Uh, so make sure you have seen part one first there, where I use my mental scissors to cut it into two rectangles of which I can find the area of. Then to find the complete area, I plus those two um, areas uh, with each other. So 92 centimeters squared is what we found. Now, instead of cutting it up, I could also make it a little bit bigger. Yeah, so basically turning it into a large rectangle and then subtracting it with the area of the part that I added. Does that make sense? I'm not sure. Let's find out the area now of the whole thing, yeah, of the whole big rectangle. Yeah? Now, that is 18 times. Now, how long is this one? It is 2 and another 7, eh? so that is 9. 18 times 9, that is 162. So, is the area is that 162? Is the total area 162? Well, yeah, the total area is, but I'm only interested in this part. So I gotta take a little bit away of that 162. Now, how much do I have to take away? Well, this part I have to take away. And what is the area of that part? So the area, let's put a minus sign there. That is seven times, and what is the length there? Hmm, 18, eight, that is 10, so seven times 10, which is 70, yeah? So basically I've made the compound figure bigger, I found the total area of that, and I'm gonna subtract it with that part I'm not interested in, 70, and that is gonna give me also 92, and I believe we were talking about centimeters square, okay? So that is indeed the same answer, yeah? So again, I'm gonna give you two options, yeah? You either, cut it up, yeah, your compound figure, cut it up um, into two rectangles, yeah, you can do it in different ways, yeah, you can have one rectangle and another rectangle, or you can have here a big rectangle and a smaller rectangle, yeah, but anyway, cut it up, find the area of each rectangle and then plus it at the end, or you could say, well, I'm making it bigger, yeah, I'm turning it into a bigger rectangle, like I've done over here, find the area of the whole thing, yeah, and then take away that part you're not interested in. It's gonna give you the same answer, 92 centimeters squared, yeah, the area of this compound figure, the L, the boot, or perhaps you can see a little flag there in it. All right, I hope that was useful. Let's have a look at the next question, which also involves the area of compound figures.